Dude Run lost the game audio for this Let's Play. So for this whole video, you'll be hearing songs where they would not normally appear due to the miracle of post-production. I tried. Hello everybody, my name is Dude, and welcome back to Delta Rune! The Switch version, aka the Violet version, or something. Door. Hello. Alright, oh, that's a door we can't go through. Right. We can't do that yet. Hello. Well, flip my flapjacks! The clowns are back in town! Well, bad news. Since you last saw me several minutes ago, I've created a brand new fighting team ready to stop you! Not even the purple girl can stop me now. <laughs> are you ready to be... Stop. Stop talking. <laughs> what is that? Why are you saying that? <laughs> it's my evil laugh. Scary, right? You sound like a baby Santa Claus. Uh, you mean like, in a badass way? Shut up. Really think you know how to be scary? <laughs> well, like... Wrong! Man, wanna be tough guys like you really piss me off. Face it, you wouldn't know scary if it picked you up and bit your face off. That's not true. Oh, really? Then why don't you prove it? We'll start with the part where your face gets bit off. <laughs> oh, okay, I get it. Thank you, purple girl. It, what? Thanks! It was kind of you to teach me how to be scary with an evil laugh. Hey, I wasn't... now. You're going to be thrashed! <laughs> Merry Christmas! What? I guess that's kind of an improvement. Yeah, it's pretty good. Uh, that one. There we go. Barry! They got Barry! Uh, oh shit. Yeah, they did get Barry. What are you gonna do? What are you gonna do about it? I'm just gonna l do that. There we go. Isn't this the part where... ...where she leaves us? Oh look, Chris! Another puzzle! Oh no. Let's read the instructions. Huh? The instructions are vandalized! It says, Thou fools, thou will never figure it out now. There are any instructions? That's definitely against the rules. And then it says, P.S. I make my own rules. R.K. Well, that explains that. Why don't we just climb over the spiked fence? Um, because then we get impaled and die? Cool, I'll work on that and you do the puzzle. Try your best, Chris! Don't look at me, Chris. Puzzles are your job. Along with everything else I don't want to do. Can't they just climb the fence with you? Seems like it'd be easier. Hey, Chris. Give up whatever you feel like it. It's all good. Now I can't give up because you're telling me not to. There we go. Puzzle's done. We don't get impaled and die. That's good, right? Damn, didn't get to impale myself. Oh well, come on, chumps. I gave you the option. Good job, Chris. Thank you for not sa thank you for not being disappointed in me about the whole like fighting everything thing we have going on here. Oh good, you didn't attack the heart guy. Face my diamond cutter! I don't want to. That's for you. Shit. I just want to, like, graze the shots. Okay. You do that. Now I've long loved the guy who pays us. Well, that's good. At least he's paying you. I was worried about that for a moment. Okay. So, there's an upward path, and I don't know where that goes. There's an upward path? Why is there an upward path? 
Where does this go? From the bottom, the order of the cards, the rooms in Card Castle. Of course, if you haven't been there, you won't know it. What? Oh no. Where are the cards in Card Castle? Oh! I've been there, but I don't remember it. Maybe I should look this up real quick and cheat. Be right back! Okay, so I'm told Diamond Heart Club Spade, so... Heart... Club... Spade. Shit. That fucked up. Okay, so how am I doing this? Diamond Heart Club Spade. Uh... Diamond... There we go. Done. Diamond Heart Club Spade. You opened the treasure chest. Inside was broken key C. You put broken key C in the key items. Okay. Good. A bit... I... I should have known this. <laughs> I played it before, so I'm technically not cheating, I'm just, like, looking up a solution that I didn't know was there. It's fine. It's totally cheating. What am I saying? Uh, you, and you... Well, at least he's not run away yet. Oh boy. Let, uh, yeah, let's let Susie do that. Alright, so we've got the first broken key. When you step into the light, you'll return to where you were before. Huh? Huh? Thankfully, that rule only applies to me. Oh, hello. I want to fight you. We're gonna fight everybody in this at least once. At least once. No one actually dies, it's totally fine. What? Oh god. Ah! Yay. Anyone next? No? Okay, I didn't think so. Ah. Good. Still no fighting, I see. <laughs> so you've begun to cross the great board. The halfway point of our ca to our castle. Hmm, impressive. So it's a shame. You won't make it a step further, because my guys are about to smash you into blood. Lots of blood. Splooshing blood. Very gross and bad. Hey, purple girl, was that scarier? Why are you asking me? Because you're really cool and being terrifying. I want to be as scary as you. That's a little flatter. You want to be like me? Yeah! Well, that's stupid. But, um, the new laugh isn't as awful. Saying you turn us into blood is cool. What the hell's up with the bucket, though? It's to put the blood in. Oh. Yeah, I'm not, uh, supposed to make a mess. Anyway, thanks for your feedback. I'm really feeling scary. Uh, no problem, I guess. <laughs> so are you guys gonna attack us, or...? Oh, yeah! I was so excited I forgot to bring any guys. But next time, it'll be the end for... I've just been calling you guys clowns. Does your team have an official name or something? Oh, Chris, we should come up with a name. No, we shouldn't. Then it's decided! Everyone puts a name in the bucket! Okay. Alright, everyone's put them in their entries. Blue person, you can choose. Cause you look like you don't care. Lancer labeled paper. Crumpled paper, neat paper. I think I chose the neat paper before, and it still chose whatever, so I'm naming it Lancer labeled paper. Take the paper with Lancer written on the outside. You open it up. On the inside, it also says Lancer. Wow, who did that one? That's really good. Wait, why do you get to choose the name? Hey, he didn't. Chris did. Yeah! It doesn't matter who may have written it. 
Regardless, Lance is going to be an absolute doom. This name feels weird, actually. I know, let's call it the Lance of Fan Club for short. See you later, me. What the fuck? The power of the Lancer Fan Club shines within you. Yay. Huh? Okay, so I'm safe to stand in the exact spot where it originally flashed. No, uh, world let me through. Thank you. Uh, do I have, like, anything? Nope, nope. Attack. I want things dead. Well, I'll say he's pretty okay with this whole, like, attacking thing. Which I thought he wouldn't be. Kind of glad for that. He's just kind of along for the ride and stuff. Eh. Eh. Okay. Max out the TP while that's going. Oh, it doesn't really matter too much. I've not spent much money. I think we're good. There was three of them. Oh, four of them. Five. Five of them are missing. Why? Hello. Hello there, horsey. Pawn men are scary, but all they're doing is following the king. Us on the board used to have our own boss. Those in more peaceful times, but now even the boss has been reduced to the king's peon. Fear not. We, unlike the simple pawn men, possess full faculty over our actions. I. Mr. Society, I'm far too intelligent to ever bow down to such a tyrant. Unless he asks me. He's very scary, you see. Fair enough. I hope they weren't saying, Whoa there, horsey, because I was attacking him. Ho ho ho! I'll step on my boots! If it isn't the Lancer fan club, you boys and girls had better turn back while you can. Lancer, what is it this time? Ho ho ho! It's... I'm simply warning you. Something extremely dangerous is lying ahead. Ho ho ho! I've actually, it's actually really inconvenient. Ha! I can't go home at all because I'm so scared. What is it? It's a... I fought this guy before. Oh, hey, little guy. That? That's what you're afraid of? Wow, Papa Girl. You aren't scared? Why would I be? What's it gonna do? Well, normally... Oh. Oh. Ah! Uh, it crushes people to death, I think. Okay, so I gotta kill it. I think. Uh, well. I'm just gonna eventually kill it. It'll be fine. They around felt stressed out and attacked. Milk? Shit. Susie, stop attacking it. You're making it stronger. Just let it think I'm afraid? No way. Alright, so I do have to act then. Deep bow. Well, fine. I do... Fine. I guess I'll, uh... Kill it. Now its crown will come off. When I smash this guy into the ground! Uh. Uh. Okay, just keep bowing. Oh. Whoa! Okay, that was unwelcome. I don't like that. Crown loosened how much? What the fuck? I don't remember that attack. Um... Check. 60% loose, okay? That's all I needed to know. I guess we just keep doing that. Uh. 
80% loose. That should bring it to... Okay, full loose. Alright. Now, Susie, you can kill it. If you want. That's totally fine. Never mind, it rolled away. We, we did it? Wow, you clowns really are heroes. You saved the next 20 minutes of my life. Yeah, yeah, I am pretty great, huh? Uh, Susie, not to downplay your contributions, but you didn't actually help at all. You only made everything worse by attacking it. If you just acted nice to it in the first place, we could have avoided that entire battle. Okay, are you for real? That thing was bloodthirsty! The only thing keeping it at bay was my axe! There's supposed to be an E at the end of that, by the way. And earlier you terrorized those troops. Those guys were enemies. They're for terrorizing. Yeah, she's right. Before that, you ate an innocent person's cake. Cakes are also my enemy. They're also delicious. Lizzie, whether you like it or not, you're a hero. One with the power to bring peace to the future. Could you please start acting like one? Yeah, when you lay it out like that, I've been a pretty bad hero, haven't I? Alright, Ralse, you got it. I'll change my ways. From now on, I won't be such a rotten hero anymore. I'll just be one of the bad guys instead! Oh, really? You're gonna be on my team? Yeah, sounds way easier, honestly. Susie, you can't just... Quiet, Toothpaste Boy! Susie is my comrade now! <laughs> Yeah, toothpaste boy. We're gonna have monogrammed track jackets. Yeah! And sleepovers, where we tell each other secrets! Uh, yeah? Anyway, uh, see you guys never. <laughs> if you can even last that long. Well, it's just you and me, boy. Chris, perhaps I shouldn't have been so hard on her. But I just worry that if Susie is too eager to fight, then... Well, let's just be kind to her, okay, Chris? I'm sure Susie will come around soon. Yeah, it'll be fine. Maybe. Probably. Most likely. Hey, kid. We managed to fix up this old thingamajig for you. It's some kind of door. You can take you anywhere you want in the world. As long as that's one of two locations. Anywho, we'll keep walking on, on it. Anything to help you out, kid. It's a door. Where will it go? Nowhere. I don't want it to go. Amazingly, you are already at the forest. Good. Oh there, horsey. Mr. Society and the Puzzle Guy fixed that door. Since it was just the three of us, it should work without any issues. Anyway, <laughs> hoping it helps you deal with the king. I hope so, too. It'll be fine. Well, no. Hello. Uh, ah. Oh god. Quit throwing shit at me, I don't like it. Run away, thank you. Okay. Kinda wonder what's the point of the whole RPG battle system and levels displayed, if it's just going to make them all flee anyway. Use is unknown. I know the glow shard of gets absorbed by, uh, Rawl say when you use it in battle, but... I haven't had a need for it after. Oh, right, I have... I have money to spend. I should probably go back and, uh, get some better gear. Spooky sword! And that, and that. There we go. And that'll do, I think. Ugh. Spooky swords, spooking this up. And the amber card. Is there anything else I should take note of? Susie, the violent tormentor left your party immediately. The power of mean girls does not shine within you. Shit! I'm saddened. The lucky foliage grows thick above your head. The power of the forest shines within you. Well, alright, we're good. 
Don't know why I make a habit of saving that often, but whatever, I'm going to end the episode here. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed. Leave a like if you did. Subscribe for more. Let me know what you think in the comments below. And thank you to Shroud Leviel for supporting me on Patreon. And thank you to Worthybird, Zarita Burrito, Dark Castle, and 3DS Master Gaming for supporting me on Twitch. And as always, I will see you guys in the next video. Bye-bye!